Hey there, everybody! It's Greggy Soriano. Today, I'm going to show you guys how to make cookies of the character Cookie from the show Empire on Fox. You're going to learn how to decorate cakes by painting on them and using modeling chocolate. You'll be getting these tips and tricks right here today on Greggy's Digest. Y'all wait to see what I do with her. Are we going to have some problems? So right now I'm cutting out a pattern out of cardstock. Just imagine Cookie's face and her boa slash bolero thingy. And this rectangle is going to have the logo of Empire. So cut all the way around and it should look like this. Oh, it kind of looks like a... Oh wait, I'm not going to tell you what that looks like. Cut out your rectangle. It's going to actually say Empire. And it's going to be an exact replica of the logo. You're going to need a silk hat, a French rolling pin, a mini offset spatula or palette knife, some flour. Dust your silk hat with a little bit of flour, and grab your favorite sugar cookie dough recipe and roll it out to at least a quarter of an inch thick. You don't want to roll it out too thin or else it'll be too fragile. Grab your palette knife and go all the way around the template that you made. The reason why I use a palette knife versus an X-Acto knife is because I don't want to cut through my beautiful silk hat. Clean up, clean up, everybody everywhere. Clean up, clean up, everybody do your sure. Transfer it onto a sheet pan and place it into the fridge. Do not move them at all. Don't forget to save your scraps and put them in the freezer. Now that your cutouts have chilled, you can lift them up with an offset spatula and place them correctly. Give them enough space so the air can circulate and bake properly. Bake them in the oven according to your recipe's directions. That's exactly 10 minutes and 30 seconds for me. Ta-da! Now that they're baked and fresh out of the oven, allow them to cool onto a rack. You see how nice and golden brown the edges are? And it should be like that on your back side too. Grab a silk pad or your favorite silicone mat for rolling out. Lightly dust your mat with some cornstarch. Grab some white modeling chocolate. Check out my blog to get the recipe. Now roll it out to the desired thickness. The reason why I love to use modeling chocolate is because it tastes a lot yummier than using fondant. It also has a softer bite when you bite into the cookie. Now trace your cookie templates once again along with the rectangles that you're going to do the logos on. Now set them aside and grab your cookies, pun intended. Grab some royal icing with an offset spatula and spread it onto your cookie, just enough so that your chocolate applique sticks to your cookie. I just said cookie a gazillion times and I probably will say it a gazillion times more because I love cookie. Now that you've stuck them on, place them in the fridge to chill. So I started painting a general outline of Cookie. I'm working on her hair, giving her some big waves, adding some texture and definition with some highlights and lowlights. Right now I'm mixing some red with a little bit of black and purple so that she has some luscious Marsala looking lips. The doctor has arrived. Ow. Grab some modeling chocolate and I have some violet right here and I want to make a nice lavender fur coat. Right now I'm busting out my modeling tools and these are used for sculpting and some different textures so I'm grabbing that. Oop, 
I got a little ADD, so I decided to paint on her dress. And I'm making a little bit of a mauve color. Now I'm making a little bit of a cheetah print, so I'm getting some black food coloring and some white food coloring to make a gray. Now I'm grabbing my modeling chocolate again and placing it onto where her fur goes. And I'm using my sculpting tools to create some texture on the fur. And here I'm using my mini scissors to create more movement and texture. Right here is my cookie that says Empire and I'm actually using some vodka with some edible gold and I'm painting gold inside the logo. And there you have it! Our favorite character, Cookie, made out of cookie! Right here is how you package them. I got some cellophane and some gold twist ties. Comment down below and tell me what your favorite line from Cookie is. And tell me what you want me to make next. Thanks for watching! Click on the cute little bumblebee to subscribe, click on the video to view my last episode on the right, and visit my website at www.greggysoriano.com. Oh, and follow me on social media in the description links down below. Thanks!